Hey guys, I just finished my Jungle First Edition set. So, I'm going to show it to you guys. And the flash is going to kill me on this, but let's see if we can do it anyway. I got Complable and Electrode. And of course, they did the uh, holographic for the first 16 of the American set. Clarion, Trunda, Jolteon, and Kings Khan. Yeah, Mr. Mime. Queen and Pidgeot. And we've got Sincere. Scyther. Scyther was the hardest one to track down. They want like, even when you can't track it down like eBay and stuff, they want a ton of money for it. It's the last card I got for this set. And we have Big Corian, and Moth, Victory Bell. We got the Vile Plume. And what are they That's the end of the holographics that they uh, made. And we have the fable, because I think the, uh, the Japanese, and, yeah, some of these are triple sleeved. The KMC perfect fit. Uh, yeah, they have perfect fit, and then they got full size, and then they got the outer, the oversized. Anyway, there's the electrode air with the base set picture, and then the actual uh, jungle one. If I get them back in there sometime. These are the BCW. Uh, side back. Hold on, sorry. No, I can't get back in there. There we go, finally. All right, they fit a lot better with the triple sleeves. Electrode, Flareon, see that one's triple sleeve, that's why they look weird. That Jolteon, Genghis Khan. They like to slip out, that's why I like the triple sleeves. Anyway, Mr. Mime. Ugh. Hello, Queen, and Giant. Oh, there's the Giant. You can see her. We got the Scyther and Snorlax, Vaporeon, Venomoth, Butcher Bell. I ordered some more of the uh, oversized sleeves for these so I can put them all in triple sleeves and then the BCW side loading pages. Right, so we got Victor Bell, Bioplume. And Wiggly Tuff. And Butterfree. Yeah, they don't like to stay in, even with the oversized sleeves. Anyway, we have Executor and Firo and Gloom. We would get the, there we go. Gloom, and then we have Lickitung, Marowak, and Arena. And Parsec version. Primeape. And then here we are. We've got Rapidash and Rhydon. Sea King. Tauros. Weeping Bell. And Bell Sprout. And Cubone. Eevee. Execute. Back up here. Goldeen. Jigglypuff. Mankey. And then this is, of course, there's a promo card of this gold border. I've got that at the end. Yeah, the Knit Arena, Oddish. They have Paris, Pikachu, and of course they have a W stamped promo of this. That one's the, one of the hardest ones to get a hold of. It came in the Duelist magazine. It's, uh, I found the magazine sealed and I found the card. It's not extremely expensive, but it's up there a little bit. And then Spiro, Baronet, and the last trainer card. And then I have the Mr. Mime Air card with no set symbol. They're not first edition, of course. There's uh, 16 of these. This is the first 16 holographics. We actually opened this out of a pack we bought off eBay. We actually opened the Air card, so I thought that one was pretty cool. And then we have, this is just a regular. We have the Gold Border Meowth. Oh yeah, there's a uh, few errors. Let's see which one was it. I think it was 60. Yeah, then it had it has well, if I can, it has this uh, line on the side of it. So that's an error, I guess. And then there's one more. It's like it's edition D. Which one is it? 30 something, I think. It's like 33, maybe 30. Yeah, there it is. Edition D, one number. 33 out of 64, yeah. Edition D error. I'm not sure if there's a non-error card of these in first edition. If there is, I'll get it. 
where it's not the edition D, it just says first edition like normal. I get the regulars and the errors. I've got other sets where I've got every single, like the cracked hollows and the the base, or not the base, uh, the deck cards, and then every promo card, etc. But anyway, yeah, it's my jungle first edition set completed finally. It took me, I think it took me about a year. I wasn't seriously collecting though, like hardcore. You could buy these all at once, I guess, if you really wanted to. But yeah, I don't know how much it costs to collect it, to be really honest with everybody. Yeah, that's, and yeah, I gotta buy some more pocket pages uh, for, I might collect the Japanese versions, I really don't know. Just like have every single card they've ever made for Jungle. I don't know, it's the first, this is the first, first edition set that I've collected. And then, yeah. Yeah, there's a Japanese booster box and stuff. This is from Bulbapedia, so shout out to them. Uh, right here is the uh, what's it? Yeah, the Duelist Magazine W promo, and then they've added to this to include uh, the D, the error cards, and then I've got the Meowth, and then the free release. That one's not super hard to find, but the Pikachu, that one's a good bit. I've got other W promos, but uh, it really was this. So number two, so it was released June 16th, 1999. I actually like had these like when they came out. So it's pretty cool to get. I didn't have the first edition, so that was pretty cool. Anyway, yeah, it's my jungle first edition set. Anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed seeing it. Going back to 1999 with me, and uh, I'll post more when I get more uh, stuff, especially when I find that uh, Pikachu W promo. Anyways, hope you guys have a good day, and I'll see you later.